Alright guys, hey guys, Zach here, coming at you with part 3 of uh, Mario Golf Advanced Tour Story Mode. So now we're going to be doing the Dunes area. So, yeah, so we're going to do the Dunes tourney, get the feel of these Dunes courses, and then we're going to battle Azalea. So this should be really interesting. I never actually, I don't actually know a person in real life named Azalea. Really interesting name, but regardless, um... Let's figure out these courts. Now, like I said, a lot of um, sand and uh, things are just overall. And cactuses. Those cactuses can be a pain, but more so the sand. Um, but dunes, the dunes aren't horrible. Um, it, like, like, when, like, to me, the lynx is the biggest pain in the butt. Um, like, dunes isn't, like, the easiest but it's not hard like once you get used to the conditions of the courses then like you know you'll kind of understand it so um so yeah so where's it she's number four right now i'm not doing too hot let's see who else is on here we got noodle at number 10 buzz and helen are on here where's ella ella's not even on the leaderboards oh yeah she is Alrighty, hole number two. Um, try that. Let's see if we can get a really powerful shot. Hopefully, come on, make it over the little hills, please. Yes, perfect. Exactly what I wanted. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, so let's do this. Well, that's good. Please. A little hard, but still on the green, so. All is well, all is well. Um. I guess just shoot. Boom. Already, there we go. Sweet, so we're already, we're already killing it, guys. Alright, par 5. Ooh, this. I don't know if I'm able to do that in. Well, I don't want to land on the rough, but. Hmm. Uh, I'm going to try for there. Let's see how well that does for me. Please. Please. Oof. Yeah, I'm glad I didn't try going for the, uh, the cactus area. Well, that's a pretty good drive, so I mean, hey. Ooh, I could make that. Make that. Do I really need... Here is it somehow went through the cactuses or cacti. Ooh, yes, perfect. So I didn't waste one of my powerful things. Take this W. Get an eagle. Perfect. I'm already in a steady lead. I could like, this could be a real domination here. Like I, you know, I could do really good with this. And then I do that. Oh, I just jinxed myself totally there. But you know, it, it's recoverable. It's recoverable. You know what? I got an eagle in that last one. So if I get a par here, it's not It's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. Yeah, it's not the end of the world. I got an eagle in the last one. So this par is not going to kill me. Perfect. So it all bounced out. So let us... Continue on. So how are you all doing tonight? Because obviously I'm doing this as a premiere. Hopefully that doesn't screw up my shot, please. Okay, good. Wow. Okay. So it's either really too far or not even close. Alright. Should be an interesting shot. So this goes well. Yeah, how are you guys doing tonight? Hopefully everyone's going well. Um, by the time this comes out, I'll be actually kind of deep into school. Giggity. Um, oh, no, 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 no. Um, but yeah, I'll be uh, doing school stuff. Oh, that was nice. Um, and uh, 
Yeah, second semester at my new college. Ever since I started at my new college, um, YouTube growth has been pretty good, so hopefully my good luck continues with the channel this year. My goal is to hit 2,500 subscribers by the end of this year. Um, and with last year's growth, that actually isn't that much, but because of how Luigi's Mansion really is what grew my content, and Luigi's Mansion 3 is now, you know, out, I'm not sure if um, I'm going to be able to regain that growth that I had before. Um, that's too soft, please. Okay. Um, but I really hope I can, because, you know, I want to I want to continue on, and I want to keep growing, I want to, you know, I want to make something of myself. I don't know. Um... Can't wait for too many games though. That's like where I feel like like all like it. When I go to too many games, it's like the culmination of me, like how how me as a YouTuber has like grown, like all the people I've met, all the things I've done, you know, the YouTubers I've collaborated with and met, and oh that was close. Um, it's just like such an honor to work with and you know alongside so many amazing people um, in the community and. And I am killing this right now, by the way. Like, even with that slow. Oh, par, par threes, though, they kill me. Which is funny, because you would think the par threes are the easiest ones. But I always undershoot. Like, I, I, my biggest fear is overshooting um, par threes, but I always undershoot them. Which is a real struggle. Ooh, can I make that? Oh, no. I have to make up for it with a birdie later. Or with a eagle, sorry. No! Well, make that make that two eagles. Oh, that's hard. Alright, that's my first bogey. Wow, someone's catching up to me, though. Can I reach that? Oh, that's... That's sketch. But I don't think I'm going to take that. I, I No, that's too risky. That's way too risky. Play it safe. But yeah, too many games is like one of those things where it's like I've I, I I don't know I just feel like so much power and so much like like not maybe not power but like I really feel how much me is like you know being a YouTuber how much has affected my life man I'm just I'm just so much happier like you know yeah I still have my really down moments please make that thank you I'm um, not gonna get the eagle but you know I'll live. Um, But, but there's moments like, you know, too many games where it's like, it's just all, oh, that would have been an amazing eagle to make up for that last stupid hole. But, yeah. I don't know what I was going on about. I mean, I was going on about too many games, but I don't really know what I was trying to say. So hopefully you all decide to attend too many games this year, because I'll be there and I'll probably say hi to you or something, I don't know. Something on my bucket list actually as a YouTuber, I want to have my own panel someday, like I want to be in a panel. Like, you know, whether it's by myself or with other YouTubers, like, I just want to be part of a panel. I don't know. It just seems like something super cool. Like, having people ask questions, like, I don't know, that's, that just, that, that kind of thing just sounds fun. Okay, let's not mess this up, Zach. Please. Oh, oh. Yes. Let's see, I'm at minus nine. Oh, that's a that's a stupid place to start me. Jeez. Yeah, start me right in front of a cactus. Yeah. Yeah, I'd appreciate that. Yeah. That was, I I I was I nearly like freaked out there. Don't know why it's, it's freaking golf, but.
speaking of golf, um, I mentioned in the last part, I was, ta I was talking about Golf Story. Um, and how it's basically like this game. Like, like you could definitely tell it was inspired by this game. Like, it's obvious it was inspired by this game. Um, just a little more complex. And I like a lot of the complex complexities it adds to it. The only complaint I had about the game is that, like, it just, ha it just some, some of the things it had you doing were a little bit too out there. Like, I wish it focused a little bit more on the competitive aspect of golf. Like, a lot of the times you were doing missions for, like, the Greenskeeper, or, like, um, you know, I remember one mission in that one beach area, you had to, like, open, like, or knock, like, knock the golf ball at trees. Like, you know, stuff like that. I don't know. I just wish there were more moments that were, like, competitive. I guess that there, I, I just wish there's more of a, I mean, the cast, like, the, the characters are pretty memorable. So I can't say the, the characters weren't memorable, but I mean, like, in terms of, like, the opponents you fought, like, all I remember, really, was that one girl who, um, thought she was better than you, and the one guy who was, like, a TV show host, or not a TV show host, he's like a, like a pro golfer or something, I don't know, but... And, I mean, I think, like, you know, this game, how it, how it really makes you feel like, um, like, you, you really get to not know your rivals, but, like, you feel like your rivals are just different than everyone else, is because, like, their, when you talk to them, their text levels have their faces on it, and it, like, looks a lot better than, obviously, their pixelated faces, like, in their sprite. So, I mean, just doing that, like, giving your characters, like, like, faces, and then showing that when they talk, like... That, it, it makes your characters just seem a little bit more, like, I don't know, individual, rather than just having a speech bubble. I don't know. I don't know, I, I'm literally just talking away, and, like, I'm just getting birdies. Like, I think I got, like, a, a bogey and maybe two pars, maybe? Well, hold on a second, the wind's intense, so let me figure this out. So, that, I'm gonna hit it less. Watch. Because the wind's pretty intense there, 11. So, please. Thank God. Oh, I could have gotten a hole in one there. I don't know how much a hole in one is worth. Is it worth minus two or minus three? I, I don't know. Okay. Can't wait to beat Azalea's boy. Like, I'm, I'm really killing it, guys. We're only at 12 minutes, and I'm almost done with the, um, with the, uh, tor with the tourney. Like, that is insane. Like, I was saying when I was, uh, in my last part, when I was up against Sherry, oh, my, I think I might miss the birdies here. Yeah, not hard enough. Um, but I was thinking when I was going to get Sherry, like, this part was, like, this is where it gets hard, and it's really not that hard. Like, I, I, I got one bogey, and I'm sitting at a minus 13, like, that might be not only a, the, the record in the game that I mentioned with, like, the trophy room and all that, but that might be a personal record. Like, I don't think I've ever done that good on the Dunes course. Like, I think the Dunes course is usually the one, actually, no, it's links I usually do horrible at. Oh, but don't, I, I can't speak too soon now, because... That's a horrible spot. Yup. Yup. Let's just do this. Hope it works. Aim a little short. Go. You know, for a par 5, that's actually not that bad. I'll accept that. That's actually pretty good. Especially for where I was at. Oh my god. I aim down here. It's going to be 11 miles an hour up, so I might want to aim at exact 22. Let's see if this works. Mm, I was close. I should have aimed a little bit more up. I was a little bit too far to the left there. Okay. Oh well. I'll still probably get the birdie. Yeah, I'll accept it. Still birdie. Alright, last hole. Let's do this. Par 4. We got this. We got this, ladies and germs. So if I don't land in that bunker, except it looks like I might. Please don't. Semi rough, I'll accept that. And. Well, that might be a little bit too hard, but then the wind is going back a little bit, so maybe I'll be fine.
Yeah, that's not that's not bad at all. Yeah, I don't think I've ever done this well on a tourney ever. Negative minus fifteen. That is amazing. Look how much experience I got from that. Let's see here. Drive, drive, shot, shot, and this be it. Yep. Wow. That that's that's gotta be a record for me. Like that's gotta be a record. And you can you can obviously go to your room in this game, and you can see all the trophies and everything that you collect and earn. So yep, there's the Lynx. The Lynx is gonna be a pain. Um, ooh, what's this? Be the yep, there we go. Yep, I beat the Dunes Tourney High Score. Um, I got hole 17, and I got 15. Yep. That was awesome. I don't think I've ever done that good. Excuse me. I think I... I want to say that... Ooh, don't leave. I want to say that... Didn't I do that for the Marion course as well? The first one we did in part one? Alright, where's Azalea at? Oh, I think she's up here. No. This... This way. And... Oh, come on. And, uh, there. There she is. Perfect. Alright, hole one. We're only at 16 minutes and we're already facing off Azalea. Like, how? <laughs> I think once I, once I'm done... Uh, oh, oh, wow. Yep, th yeah, the wind. I just, I just realized the wind has increased. Like, that's a strong wind. This is where it's gonna get hard. Like from this point on, this is when it's gonna start get, to get hard. I, I guess the tourney wants to just, I guess, prepare you a little bit. But now the wind has set in. This is gonna be hard. <laughs> it's not gonna be easy. So maybe this video will be normal length because I'm kind of stuck behind a cactus here too. So I don't, I don't you know, uh, yeah. That's not particularly great, but if, if, ooh, I'm going to take a gamble here. Because the wind's going left, I should be able to hit without going out of bounds. Here's the question, though. Am I correct? The answer is yes. Not to a spot that I'd love to be at, but regardless. Oh, I have like I haven't played this game in such a long time. Like, like it's been a while, like at least a couple years, maybe, since I've like been in this game. Ooh, yeah, this wind, this wind's gonna be a challenge. This is gonna be hard. Come on! Oh! Come on, please don't make it. Please. And she made it. Oh, this is gonna this is this is gonna be my downfall. This is gonna be where it all ends. Oh, okay, wind here's a little more manageable at seven. Freaking sixteen. I think that's the highest we've seen so far. Hit that cactus. Oh dang. Yeah, sixteen, holy crap. What games did you guys, you know, since I'm obviously going to be in the chat here with you guys, what games did you guys play growing up? Like, did you guys play games like I did? Like, you know, mostly like a lot of Game Boy Advance and... Because, like, when I was a kid, I had the original Xbox, um, and obviously a Game Boy Advance. Um, I can't see where the freaking flag is. It's freaking cactus in the way. Um, 
but but yeah, I played a lot of uh, Game Boy Advance, original Xbox. I played GameCube quite a bit. Didn't get my first GameCube until I was like eight or nine, though. So um, okay, I don't know what. Um, but yeah, it was a while until I got my first GameCube. Um, but I played it all the time at my stepbrother's house. Um, but Game Boy Advance is probably my most played console of my main childhood. And by main childhood, I mean, like, first, like, seven years of my life. So maybe that's more so early childhood. Thank God. Alright, oof. Alright, four miles an hour. Again, not too bad. But, oh my lord. <laughs> this is... This is something else. Fairway. Oh, that's a cactus. All right, wind. I, I, I always forget. I really. Oh, I, I was farther away. That sucks. I always forget to account for the wind. Literally every single time. And it, it usually. That's unfortunate. That. That is unfortunate. That. That. Please hit it. Please hit it. Please land in the water. Please. Oh. Because I'm probably going to be at least two shots until... Oh. 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 Yeah, it's going to take me a little while to get over there. Oh, if you land in the... Okay. I was going to say, if that landed in the water, I would have been so mad. Okay. Now, the only way I can see myself winning this one is if I come in clutch and somehow get it in. I chip it in. Quite frankly, I don't see that happening. So, all I gotta hope is for her to miss. But she's like right there, so I have no clue how she's gonna miss. <laughs> to be quite honest with you. Like, look, she's right there. Unless she really screws up in terms of power here. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. All right, yeah, we know. She got an eagle there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We didn't even see that. <laughs> oh, and a par three's up next. Oh, great. I'm getting my butt handed to me. Oh. I was literally just... I don't get... Like, literally, that tourney was so easy. Like, so easy. You saw my score. That was child's play. But nope. Come to the actual match with Azalea, and I'm getting my butt handed to me. Like, on a silver platter, my name right on it. Though I actually made it on the green. This is, a sh this is breaking news. Zack Pack made it onto the green in Mario Golf. Rare occurrence. Please, don't you dare make that, okay. One second, at least catch up, please. Yes, okay, at least I, I caught up. No, I didn't. I thought I did, but never mind. The math sucks. For some reason, I thought that I was only one behind her, but I was not. Evidently. I mean, it's it's not impossible for me to win. I mean, literally, it's only like, she's got two, I've got one, we got like eight to go. So, I mean, like I said, we're going to be at this for a little while. This is this is going to be a more interesting match. Oh, Like, like I said... I literally said this in part two. It's like, Sherry and Joe are the easy ones. Won't lag. Joe and Sherry are the easy ones. Once you get to Azalea and, and Kid, nah, uh They don't kid around. <laughs> no? No? Okay. Well, that's a pretty bad shot, so maybe... Maybe I do stand a chance, after all. Okay, so I gotta hit a little bit harder than I'd really want to. So I might want to hit it all the way. Right? That makes sense? Because of how freaking stupid the wind is? Or not! Alright, never mind. Point, point, point proven wrong. Okay, cool beans. Glad I experimented. Cool. Hopefully she gets the brunt of that too, please. 
I mean, she's pretty far away, but... I mean, obviously, we're getting, like, upper level now, so I see her probably making that in. I'm not gonna try to put that. That'd be stupid. But I can... I, I gotta barely hit this. Actually, that'd be okay. Or not. All right, never mind. Yeah, no. I was like, that was way too far away for her to accurately make that. Oh, yeah, I can still win. Wait, wait, no. Okay, maybe this way. Please. Oh, that sucks. Well, you know what? I'll accept the tie. I'll accept a tie at this point. Oh, I didn't get for the wind. Oh, please don't screw me over. I should have that bad. Okay, I'll, I'll accept that. I'll, I'll accept. I'll do pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. She has a better shot than me, though, probably because of her elevation. Oh, Lord. Yeah, this holds nine miles an hour, so I really have to account for that wind. Like, look how much that wind screwed her over. Oh, my Lord. Okay. Oh, there's a cactus there. Like, how far way too far out so I'm gonna have to really try and gamble here and hope to god this works my shot actually ended up better than hers and I actually aimed it right at the hole and she aimed it to the right like you should have I got like this, this game does have some inconsistencies I, I do think it's because of the fact that it's like don't you dare make that I think it's because of the fact that this is a Game Boy Advance game, too. Like, it's not like a GameCube game where they probably have, like, more put into it in terms of, like, like, um, like, like, the, the, obviously the GameCube game is obviously more capable because, you know, it's a GameCube game. Oh, this is going to screw with me. I shouldn't have moved it. So that's what I understand. The wind is going, like, nine miles an hour to the left. Yeah, we know she's gonna win. We know she's gonna get it. We know she's gonna get it. All right, skip along. God, if I lose this, I'm actually gonna be really upset. Cause I'm actually kind of tired. Not gonna lie. What time is it? It's only quarter to ten. At night, of course, not in the morning. I don't fall asleep that early. All right. Thankfully, it's a pretty bad shot from her. So hopefully, I do a little bit better. Hopefully, here's the hoping. Get up the hill. That's all I want. Up the hill. Up the hill. Actually, that, actually, that, that might be an okay shot. I might be okay there. Please hit that cactus. Please. Nope. Hit another cactus? No? Oh, well. She's in the rough. Please. Um... Yeah, that should be fine. Theoretically. Please. Okay, I'm on the green. A little bit closer. <gasps> Ooh, nice! That is nice. That is juicy and beautiful and nice and everything I could have wanted. So as long as she doesn't chip this in, I should be basically set here. Okay. Boom. Beautiful. Okay, so we're still only one behind her. She's got six to win. I got seven to win. We could still do this. This is going to be a long hit. Oh, we're at 16 miles an hour again, though. And on the par three, too. Like, that's that's like the like the double hook, right? Like, that's literally looks like a, like a left-right, like, alternate jab. And not to mention I hit it too light. And I hit a cactus. And I'm on a hill in front of that cactus. I might as well just accept defeat on this one. 
I mean, unless she royally screws it up too. Which she kind of did, but, like, it's nowhere near as bad as this. Oh, boy. Okay, if I hit it... Though, if I hit it this way... Let me see if that'll get me onto the green. Oh. Not even hard enough to get me to the green. The wind... Oh, I hate the wind, man. She's gonna, she's gonna beat my butt on this one. Oh, that would have been so nice. That would have been beautiful if I made that in, but nope. She's gonna make it. Yeah, it sucks. Now she's two ahead. Oh, oh yeah, this hole. Ooh, I did upgrade. Maybe I'll be able to make it to that little island and guarantee myself a paw or a, an eagle. Maybe. It's possible. Do I want to gamble that? Okay, I can definitely reach now. Holy crap. Do I want to risk that? Yeah, I, th I think I can. I think I, I think I can risk it. That is a please build a fairway, semi rough. I might be able to hit, to salvage that. I think that was one of my best shots ever. Very well, possibly one of my best shots ever. Beautiful. Okay, so guys, count for the win. I think I might have underdone it a little too much, actually. I did underdo it, but I'll accept that. I can accept that. You see, my my driver has really good distance. Like, I don't have like all that spin and technique stuff, but I have the distance to where. On par fives, it could really work out in my favor. But you're not making that. What was that? That was awful. I mean, not actually got that bad. Just looked awful. I got hit a little bit over because of the wind, but I don't want to hit it too much over. Beautiful. Okay. Par four. Four miles an hour. Okay, I think I can hit it there. Beautiful. I think that's a that's a fine spot. Please don't screw me over. Though she does have a nice spot because she's up on a higher elevation. Like usually, if you're up on a higher elevation area. You're basically guaranteed to have a good shot, as long as there's no, like, trees, or in this case, cacti, on that upper level. Because usually, obviously, if you're on the upper level and everything's down below, you can just go over a lot of the hazards. So, she's about to land in the bunker. Interesting. Ah, oh, That's what I did not want to happen. Oh. That sucks. That really sucks. So I guess it didn't really matter anyways. Um, okay. Might be a little hard, but... Please? Yes. Next one wasn't really that hard at all. Okay. Please, Bunker, screw her over somehow, please. Alright, looks like we. Oof. As long as I don't miss, we should be able to get a tie here. Oh, thank God. I was 
scared there for a second. I was like, no, I'm not going to lose this one. Come on. Okay, oof. Oof. This is... Okay, there's no win, so thank bleeding God for that. But this is a par 3, which is my known weakness. And that was probably too hard, but do you know what? I'll be fine. Actually, no. Actually... Oh! If I had gone just a little more, I could have gotten a hole in one. Oh, that is... That's heartbreaking. That is absolute tragedy. And she... Completely botched it. There is hope. There is hope for me after all. Wow. She really botched this one. Though, so, nice recovery. But, you know, my amazing shot. You know. Oh, we're tied now. Okay, we're tied. Jeez. And by the way, you guys... <laughs> it's like halfway. Like, I still gotta get four more wins. And I just got my fourth one. Like, are you kidding me? And I have a horrible shot. Oh, bunker, bottom of the hill, and a cactus in front of me. Okay. Zach, stop taking the risky routes to try to get distance. It doesn't work on par fours. It only works on par fives. Oh, sugar plums. Oh, she didn't make it, though. No, neither am I. So I can't say anything. Let me just hop out here. Alright, so as long as I get onto the green... As long as I get onto the green, I sh we should be able to tie this. And I'll be fine with that. Oof, that's, that's rough, though. Like, when I said get it onto the green, I meant a little bit closer to the hole. Granted, I did quite obviously undershoot that. Well, that doesn't matter anyways. Jeez, nice chip in there. Okay, I gotta catch up now. Okay, this is a par 5. This is my jam. Like I said, distance is important for par 5s. Because obviously the main objective is to get like as far under par as you can so if I can get over there quick enough I'll be able to avoid all that nonsense though the wind is pretty damn high not gonna lie just land on the fairway please land on the fairway semi rough I'll accept that that works too as long as it's not the rough or the heavy rough then I'm fine or the bunker Oh no, wait, I can make that. Because that wind's strong, so I might want to go a little strong. That's too strong. Oh, that just, oh, that, that, that made me tear up a little bit. Because that means this is probably going to be a time. I think this is the last par five. Unless she misses this. And she did. Ooh. Yeah, well, well, I'm definitely not going to miss the next shot. So, as long as she doesn't chip this in, I should be fine. Yes. Oh my god, beautiful. So now we're at least going to be caught up. Ooh, 
Ooh, oh god, I thought that was too soft for a second. I was gonna be so mad. Okay. At least she's not beating me anymore. Okay, don't... Don't go for the bunker. Like, that's that's a no-no. There's no wind here, so I probably could have managed to go around it, but... I'm just gonna play it safe. Oh, that's not what I wanted, though. Oh, that's not really... Not exactly what I wanted, but... I'll have to make it work. Well, she's basically the same exact spot as me, so... Can't see a thing. And may I mention that those are some of the biggest cacti I've ever seen. And I'm going to try and put it from there, because I think I might be able to. I try hard enough, I probably could. I just gotta judge the, uh, the, the strength right. Wow! That was way off. So again, don't chip it in. Okay. So I gotta chip it in. So, here's to hoping. Too hard! Okay. I, I, it's, it's so hard to judge that sometimes. Please, miss. Oh my god, you're not gonna, but please. Oh. Okay, well. Okay, still three. Oh, great. Speaking of three, it's only it's only two miles an hour wind. You can do this. I think that's actually a pretty good power hit. Right? Ooh. A little on the strong side, but yeah, nice. It's pretty good. It's an interesting tactic she's going for. Not exactly making it... Oh, there we go. Very last second change there. But whoa, is she off. Holy crap. The wind's not even going that way. Oh, uh, she's not on the... F Actually, no, she's not on the fringe. Maybe she can chip it in, but I really hope she doesn't. Please don't. Okay. Please, yes! Okay, I'm one ahead. Holy crap. Okay, this is a par four. Don't try anything fancy. 11 miles an hour, and it's going in the direction we kind of want it to. So the wind actually might work in our favor here, as long as we're able to judge the distance and power accordingly. Wow, we are already at 43 minutes. Yeah, I knew, <laughs> I knew this was gonna last longer. I was like, holy crap. Like, this is a more fierce competition. But I guess it's good. It makes it, I guess, a little more interesting to watch. Like, rather than me just absolutely dominating, it's actually a little, it's actually a little bit hard. I wonder how I'll do in the links. Okay. Um. Oops, now I wanted. Okay, so I gotta judge that. So let me go back one. Maybe that will help. Can't see where the hole is because of this, so I guess... Kind of wing it. Hope for the best. Ooh, nice. Hopefully the wind doesn't screw me over with my putt. But if I can make that in, then... then it's basically game set. No oh no, please don't. She just did. She literally just did that. Please. Please. Okay, thank God. Okay, so... I Now I only have to win one. So I guess it was kind of a win for me. Oh, this is a par 5. Let's freaking go. Just don't mess up on this one. Oh, but the wind! Oh! Oh, no! Oh, no! I wanted... Oh, that's not what I wanted. Oh, that's... But you know what? They always go for for a birdie, because I, I, I usually try to go for an eagle on par 5. So, she's trying to go for a, a birdie, so I still have an extra stroke. I actually might be able to weave between these cacti. Hmm. 
If not, then I'll just have to do a setup shot over to that, like, kind of corner area. So, we'll have to kind of see on that. Please, I would love to win. Please, let me win. Oh, yes! Okay. So, that's like that. Let me do that. No, no I want that to be right freaking on. There. Okay. So, now... Please. Oh, please. Please. A little over. My fringe, I'm still fringe. Yes. Fringe is so much easier to deal with than, um, than the rough. Okay. So if I can make this in, that would be lovely. Please. I don't think I'm gonna... Please. Yes! Yes! Oh, that's a win for me, boys and girls. Yes. Oh, my God. That... That was... That was difficult. Not gonna lie. Do the shot. Impact. And... So we unlocked Azalea. Now we can go and face off against Kid and Lynx. But, that's not going to be until the next part. <laughs> Wowzer. Tiny's her partner. So it's like, if you if you do doubles, then you can um, um, go against their partner. So her partner's Tiny. I think Sherry's partner's Grace, and then Joe is Putz. So I'm going to try and defeat this guy, and then we're going to end this part. Yep, there we go. So we hit this guy two more times. Oops. Try to hit this goofball. Okay. Okay, there's another hit. So one more. How close am I allowed to get to him? Come on. Yes. Okay. I'm gonna kind of have it somewhat on the left, but I don't want to completely miss, too. Okay, try that. So if I hit him, I think if I miss, I have to, it completely resets. Oh, I'm gonna miss. Wait, did I? I did. I just barely hit him with the ball rolling. Yes. What's this? Is this another ticket? Ooh, this is ticket C. Yay. Alright, well, that's going to be it for this part of Mario Golf Advance Tour. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, hope you enjoyed. And um, until next time, I'll see you guys in the next part.